All right, boys, how are ya? This is Nick with Logger Than Life, and today we've got something I'm pretty, pretty excited about. A little bit of an international affair, if you will. We've got two Hefeweizens, blind taste test. Uh, the cameraman poured the beer, I have no idea what's in what, um, but we're gonna be testing two Hefeweizens. Um, so if you're kind of new to craft beer, a Hefeweizen's a great beer to jump into, um, partly because it's always noticeable, it's, it's always gonna be cloudy, um, it's got a little bit more sweeter notes, banana notes. It's personally one of my favorites, very drinkable. Uh, personally, I've been to Munich and enjoying liter after liter of a, a delicious Hefe. There's nothing better than that. So with that said, let's get down to it. My first, just, just looking at it, you know, we've got one with a decent amount of head. I'm gonna assume the one with the head's the German beer. So I'm assuming, let's say this is A and this is B. I'm gonna assume, firstly, that, that B is German. Um, and that's the reason why I'm gonna go for it first. So, it's, uh, it's got, you know, kind of a lighter mouthfeel. I'm almost starting to doubt my, my first intentions. <laughs> um, just because I expected more of a mouthfeel from the, the Weinstefaner, which is our German counterpart. Um, we've got Mission Hefeweizen here which I'm thinking now might be what I just drank, but this is how this is gonna go. I'm gonna be back and forth, but ultimately, I'll give you with an idea of which one's the best. Uh, it's tough, guys. Uh, so with, with beer B here, this is A, this is B, um, it's got more spice, which is surprising because typically the more German beer has more spice. So, just uh you're gonna always notice banana flavors with a half of icing I'm definitely picking that up with this one so I'm gonna say this is mission this is uh, fine Stefaner and honestly I'm, I'm kind of preferring if this is mission the mission or spice and then we've got the less of the head which I was feeling like this was mission and this is Vines Funner, but I think the uh, truth's been revealed. The German or the American beer, which one was which? The German one is the one that you reached for just now, the one on your right, my this left. This is the Vines Funner? Yep, and the other one is Mission. And this is Mission, all right. So my, <laughs> my internal gut went with the German beer, which maybe that's why you gotta get out there and, and go to Munich and enjoy some of this German brew. Not to knock, obviously, our, our great craft scene we got out here in the States, um, but, I mean, hell, Vine Stefaner's been brewed since, God knows, I should know. Uh, well, I mean, they've got the purity law since 1516, and it's one of the older breweries, um, so. Did you say 1040 up on the top? Yeah, there you have it. Fucking thousand years, almost. That's that's incredible. Um, and And it's just, the original always tends to be the best. So if you're watching this video trying to get an idea as far as what to drink tonight, maybe you're not so used to foreign beers, highly recommend a solid German brew like Weinstefaner. But, however, not to knock Mission Brewery, they also have a great counterpart. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Let me know what you think in your comments. Um, if you have any suggestions as far as good Hefe's in the SoCal region, or perhaps a, a good German Hefe that's your favorite, we want to hear about it, we want to try it. Cheers, thanks for tuning in.